Hey everybody, you know who it is? It's your boy, Jason, Barry Harley Davidson. I know, you're probably sick of me. Anyway, long and short of it, we're gonna try something new here at Barry Harley Davidson. A lot of people do a whole unboxing experience online, uh, YouTube. Uh, they grab a brand new product that's new to a company. They open it up, they talk about it, they kind of share some features. We're going to start doing that with a lot of our new product and we're actually going to start with our brand new um, Life Lithium Ion Batteries. They're not so new, they've been out for in and around a year now. Um, but that being said, a lot of people have had a lot of questions about the weight differences from AGM to lithium. I just wanna scrape the surface on uh, a few features. Very light, uh, very small. This guy comes in in and around 3.34 pounds, the battery itself, there is a holster for it. Um, that being said, I'm gonna get right to it and open it up and get to work. So in the box, like I said, you're gonna get a battery. You're going to be getting a um, set of instructions because everybody needs to know how to install a battery. <laughs> you're going to be getting some brand new hardware because if you're going to be going to the new lithium ion batteries, you're definitely going to want some brand new hardware, something clean, uh, nothing that's uh, rusted or a little pitted or anything of that nature. You want to make sure you get really great contact from the battery cables. This is what you see. Uh, this battery right here, like I said, about 3.34 pounds, very light. When this came into our building, uh, my manager, Ryan, ended up throwing this at me. Uh, and I caught it, and I thought it was a big joke, and this was just our dem demonstration battery, just a hollow plastic battery. This is, in fact, a battery. You'll see in the box, uh, you get a cradle. Basically, what this is, this is the touring battery. And the reason that this comes with a cradle is because the uh, box where your AGM battery goes underneath your seat of your touring bike is very big and spacious so we need to fill that and you really need it to be safe and secure um, so that the battery's not moving around uh traditional harley orange and black colors uh what you're going to see is top mounting point area and you're going to see side mount uh, this is really handy if you have a lot of accessories on your bike and you need to run a whole bunch of extra wiring under the seat so that uh, you can um, use your space accordingly and not really interfere with the way the mounting is. More often than not, people install their batteries and it's a real bugger to be able to take it out and do any work on the battery. So they've given you the option to mount from the top, which makes life a lot easier. You'll notice right on the top of the battery, uh, there is a little test port. Uh, there are three indications. Uh, there's low, medium, and full. Uh, and basically what that is, is at any point in time, you wanna lift up your seat and see where your battery's at. Just press that little test button and it'll light up. Obviously all three lights tell you it's full uh, and if you're at low then obviously you really want to tend that battery. Uh, the Life Lithium Ion product is a great product. Basically the way this battery works, give the battery one full charge right before winter, completely disconnect the battery from your bike, put it on a shelf, come springtime you don't even have to charge it up. You fire it back in your bike and fire up your motorcycle and you're on your way. Um, we always promote tending the battery. Basically, any of the newer motorcycles that have security on them, there's always a constant draw. So you want to make sure that you're always tending your battery, regardless of whether you're riding or not. But basically, if you just want to, you know, if you're in an area, you're storing your bike in an area where you can't physically plug in a tender for the few months of winter, then unplug the battery, put it on your shelf, give it a full charge, and then come spring, put it in, fire it back up, and you're good to go. It's nice and tightly in the holster. Uh, once that sits right underneath your saddle, uh, it will not move whatsoever. Once it's all strapped down under the seat, it is safe. There is no risk of tip over, falling, shaking, anything of that nature. And the cool thing about this cradle is there's a lot of that extra space around the battery as I discussed earlier about uh, your accessories. A lot of people put lighting kits on their motorcycles and we need to tuck a lot more wiring up underneath the seat. That allows you to do so. That's pretty much on this battery right here. I'm gonna discuss a few other things in regards to cold cranking amperage, uh, power, all that kind of stuff, but I'm actually gonna bring back in the standard AGM battery that you're used to. This is the guy right here. Standard battery, what you're used to. You'll see outside of the box, the cradle, major difference in size. Uh, these guys are coming off with maximum amount of uh, cold cranking amperage. These guys are registered at 405 cold cranking amps. Harley sets their batteries up where they're coming off the shelf already with a minimum of 50 to 100 more cold cranking amps than the battery is actually rated for. This guy right here, uh, basically right from the shelf, uh, you're looking at about 480 cold cranking amps. We haven't been able to test this. It takes a certain type of bench tester to be able to test a lithium ion battery. That being said, 480. 
405. If Harley makes this battery the same way they make these, you're looking at a minimum of 50 to 100 more cold cranking amps off this guy, uh, right off the shelf. There's the three different batteries, Touring, Soft Tails, your Dynas, your mid-sized bikes, and then you have your Sportster. Standard AGM battery sits at 21-ish pounds. This is 3.34, plus your cradle, you're in and around three and at between three and a half to four pounds. Your mid-class cruiser motorcycles, those batteries weigh 15 pounds and the lithium ion are sitting at about 2.8 and then your Sportsters are coming off at 11 pounds for the AGM and then the lithium ion are 2.2. Definitely a phenomenal product. We have a few of our clientele that already use these and have nothing but great things to say about it. No Harley states that you can technically take it off your bike and you don't have to worry about charging it but anytime there's a draw you want to make sure you're firing your bike up with maximum uh, cold cranking amps and amperage every time you throw a leg over. We've had great feedback, nice, lightweight, small, feels plastic, uh, definitely hasn't let anybody down and we highly recommend you come on in uh, whenever you're ready for your next battery purchase. Ask any questions you want, we'd be happy to demonstrate, show you how it works and fire one into your bike for you. Any questions, please feel free to come into our parts department. Again, it's your boy Jay here, Barry Harley Davidson. We wish you an excellent day and thanks for tuning in.